Good day. In this video, we are going to solve question 1A to 1C of the June Numeracy Paper 2023. The title of this paper is Use Mathematics and Statistics to Meet the Numeracy Demand of a Range of Situations. The paper number is 32406 and you can see the outcome. There are three outcomes. One is formulate mathematical and statistical approach to solving problem in a range of meaningful situation. Two, use math and stats to meet the numeracy demand of a range of meaningful situation. And three, explain the reasonableness of mathematical and statistical response to situation. So you need to get a number of questions from outcome one, two, and three to pass this paper. So before we go on, let's do it. We're going to do question 1A to 1C. And then we in another video, we're going to do uh, further question from question one. So without further ado, let's do question 1A to 1C. Okay, the first question, let me adjust the question. Okay, let's read the question together. Question 1A, May works at a cafe. For each day May's work, the cafe gives her $10 for travel. May works for 8 hours a day. She is paid $22.70 per hour. Show how you would calculate May's pay for one day. So May's pay for one day is the number of hours she worked at the rate of $22.70 plus $10 for travel. So to calculate that, we need to take this number amount here. He is paid $20. $2.70 per hour because she worked for 8 hours you multiply by 8 okay and then the company pays her $10 for travel so you're going to add $10 so now we're going to add use the calculator 22.7 times 8 the answer is going to be 181.6 and then you're going to add the travel that the company pay for $10 and the total amount is 191 and 60 cents. So that is the first question. If you get it right, you get outcome one. And we'll proceed to question 1B next. Okay. So 1B looks like this. So the question in 1B is now uh, going to adjust the paper. So 1B looks like this. Okay. So we're going to read. Carl delivers community newspaper. He is paid an amount of $27.30 to deliver all his newspaper. This will take him 90 minutes. How much is Carl paid per hour? So total pay is $27.30 for 90 minutes or one and a half hours or 1.5 hours. So to calculate how much Carl is paid, very simple, you take this amount here. So he's going to pay $27.30 and then you're going to divide by total number of work hours work so he's going to work 1.5 hours so you put in the calculator and the answer is going to be amount of $18.20 and that will give you outcome 2 as I said you need a number of outcome 1 outcome 2 and outcome 3 to pass this paper cheers now we're going to do question part C okay part C sounds like this okay we shall read the question Kate Moe's lawn Kate con can container here can hold five liters of petrol. It is already one quarter full. It is over one quarter full. Petrol costs two dollars seventy six cents per liter. How much will it cost Kate to fill the rest of the container with petrol? So we know it's one quarter full. So three quarters empty. So to fill up the three quarter, so we're going to take three quarter, multiply by five liters because. The whole container is 5 liters, you need to fill up 3 quarters and you calculate that it's going to be 3.75 liters of petrol into the container. So to calculate the price of petrol here to pay, the petrol cost 276 per liter. So there are 375 liters, okay? 3.75 liters will be 3.75 multiplied by the cost which is $2.76 and put in your calculator and the answer is going to be $10.35. If you get this right, you get another outcome 2 for this paper. So you have outcome 1 for question 1A, outcome 2 for question 1B and 1C. So we will keep on going until we get a amount of question right. So we will pass this and this is worth 10 credit in this paper. Cheers everyone and have a good day.